welcome back to another awesome video of Hegito's Gaming, and today we're going to be rejoining the land of FTL. And I figured we'd start right here at this screen, get everything set up. Alright, everything looks set up. I installed the Captain's Edition mod. Now what this does is it adds a bunch of new stuff into it, and helps improve upon the game. So, hopefully... I didn't read over the wiki, so I don't know what to expect. So we'll get right into it and see what happens. The data you carry is okay. This doesn't seem... Oh, wait. It does. Tip. Ship size. The amount of rooms an enemy ship has factors into how effective certain drones are against them. Most drones excel when attacking smaller ships because they are more likely to hit crew and systems. Alright. You prepare the ship for an FTL jump. I haven't even done anything. Socialize with your crew while the F. What? No, dude, this is cool. Consider some upgrades to your custom ship equipment. Produce something on board the ship. Um. Hmm. You know what? I'm pretty social. I'm just gonna socialize. Oh wait. See what you can find. Look around. Have a word with my humanoid crew member. Boop. Your human crew member sits alone in the mess hall. Captain, are you on duty? Want to share a ration? This person is obviously troubled. What's wrong? Is it that obvious? It's this sector, Captain. I lost someone who was very dear to me shortly before the rebellion. Public order broke down. The orbital I was on stationed the orbital I was stationed on was raided by slavers several times. Honestly, it was always my wish to return here with a fully militarized warship. I see you want to track down these slavers. Ah wait, I see. You want to track down these slavers? Our mission will make the galaxy safe again. Mm, let's do number one. I'm not out for revenge, Captain. But I would want to know what happened to... You nod in agreement. Mm-hmm. The slaver's hideout is well known. I will calculate a course. Thank you, Captain. Added a quest marker to your map. All right. And hey, it still has the space bar features. So there's... N oh, there he is. I, I didn't see where he was. You know what? I want you on shields. And then we'll save their positions. Boop. Alright. And... Hmm. Alright, so nothing too much has changed. There's some texture changes. Uh, some new weapons. Upgrades all seem the same. So let's... Oh, here's the quest. Let's go beat up some slavers. Yeah! Revenge for my crew member. Alright. Have my crew member point me. Your crewman takes a long look at this system act. There was always rumors claiming that they are hiding within the atmosphere of this gas giant. Another dedicated stand scan re verifies these rumors. Get us in the orbit. Let's take down some slavers. Oh, wow. I'm actually in the clouds. Is this a station? What? Oh, that's a station. Alright, so, I want auto fire on. Let's take out their shields. Oh wait, missile to the shields, because that goes through shields, and then laser on weapons. And they just teleported over. I need weapons, dude, and... and oh no! Beat them up, beat them up. And mid bay is down. Well, this isn't going as planned. Uh, this will... Alright, take out those weapons. Get Jared out of there. And we're back. Um, I don't know what happened. My game, I think crashed so looks like we're just gonna have to start over yay all right so by resorting to piracy will delusion your crew and make them desert your cause oh wow socialize have a word 
Do do. This gives you an I wait was stationed here in the system. The crewman's ID codes from for the world are still valid. You are able to access the beacon network and download data on the surrounding beacons. Cool. Chase, I want you on shields, buddy. Like last time. Although last time I got screwed. I got screwed really quick and I started losing crewmen. And that's not good. We won't let that happen again. There's a stress call here. There's a store up there, so we'll go here, 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 store. Who's in distress? Oh. Okay, so it was a trap. Continue. No, he's mind controlled. Really? Really? Alright, so I want shields offline, and I want weapons offline. No, don't do it. You can resist it. Fire! Hmm. Well, that's a good, um... It's a good amount of stuff, you know? You know what? Peaceful. Yay. I could dishonor it. But I'm, I'm gonna honor it. After I repaired the, um, cockpit, then we'll jump. Hmm. Well, I don't have enough for any of that. I'm sorry, sir. Actually, I could attack him, but now I can't because I just denied it. Oh, well. Let's head to the store. What is up, store buddy? Oh, the store is a lot different. Hmm. Oh, wait. This is uh, not the actual store, huh? Oh, that's cool. Drones, drone control. That's too much. I can't get a new crew member because I don't have enough money. Fix. Let's uh, just buy some more uh, fuel and more missiles. Can I sell anything? No, I don't really have anything that needs selling. So let's just jump here. Yeah. Oh, it's a never nebula. I, I keep forgetting to look at that. Uh-oh, it's a pirate. Let's attack them. How dare they come into this system? What? Are, oh, they have drones. All right, I want uh, the weapons down and shields. Now, see, the thing is, let me explain something really quick. Dual lasers, they can't go through shields. So, the best thing to ha have them do is attack weapons. But missiles can go through shields. So, you take out the shields with the missiles and then fire your lasers at the weapons. Um, let's just finish the attacking. Does my uh, crew members not like that or something? No, uh, let's not have that attack because I don't want to waste my missiles. Yeah! Ooh. I got a new person. What are they, NG? I think they're an NG. Um, you can go in the engine room. Go on, little buddy. Yay. So now engines are powered up more. Cool. Alright, let's uh, jump here. You can travel to the next sector. Oh, I don't get to do any special things. It's just... Yeah, nothing. Hm. It's nice. Alright, let's jump to the next sector. Oh... Huh. Mobile shipyard at blah blah blah. Let's go there. Maybe we can get a ship. What? What is this? Hmm. You managed to escape the rebels and flee the sector. If you spend additional fuel during the long range jump, you might even get ahead of the fleet in the next one. Basic engine, travel at minimal FTL speed. Oh, so I'm in FTL right now. Huh. 
basic engines travel at minimal FTL speed to the next center using only emergency fuel standard engines. Travel at standard FTL speed to the next sector using the usual amount of fuel. Emergency. Fleet. Okay, never mind. You know what? You know what? You know what? We'll just do standard from now on. A bleak fate has befallen this sector. It has been taken over by an automated rebel factory fleet. Machines that do nothing but build other machines. Which then either fight for the rebels or build even more machines. Oh. Ooh. You know what? Let's do that. Yay. Well, I guess that thing came in handy then. Hmm. Let's, uh, jump here. Uh-oh. You catch a group of humanoids wiretapping into a rebel communication site at this beacon. They gladly answer your hails. What a surprise! We did not expect to meet other living souls out here. You obviously are no rebel machine. So I guess you don't have to concert yourself with our little operation here. Yes, we mine rebel intel here in case that matters to you. Inquire about intel. It's mostly logistics data. Some of it is quite valuable if you know what to do with it. You sound interested. Care to buy? Um, that's a lot, bro. You know what? I'm, I would have to decline. I'm sorry. I don't have enough. You know what, though? I am going to upgrade. I am not going to upgrade weapons. Can I take that? Huh. I'll upgrade it later. Let's, uh... Let's go to the nebula. You know, the nebula sounds fun. Oh no, you're inside an acid cloud. You spend a good deal of time staring out the window. Yay. Oh great, acid eats away your ship while you wait for the FTL to charge. Suddenly a heavy corroded rebel ship scout bursts out of the cosmic clouds. The rebels must have sent it into the hazard zone to keep track of you. Oh no. Well, we cannot let it, um, get away. Fire all weapons. Actually, let's have this dude take out shields. And never mind. Alright, cool. Now it's not going anywhere. You lo just lost your redundant environmental sensors. The acid levels must be off the chart. The fighting brought you into a much denser part of the acid cloud. The caustic substances took a toll on your plating and start causing considerable damage. Hull breaches detected. Oh no. This dude is a jerk and this hurts. Oh no, oh no. Get in there and repair oxygen. Oxygen is something I need right now. Doors, also something I need. The AI of the automated scout remains online for a brief moment after its host ship explodes before shutting down for good, unconscious as its remains are looted. Stay to salvage from your opponent. Jump. Uh, let's just stay. I want it. Yay. Oh, no. Repair engines. I need to get out of here. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Oh, no. He can't go in there. Alright, get in the med bay. That needs to be repaired. Oh, wow, you get healed while you're doing it. That's cool. I'll be right back. Alright, let's jump. And then, what is here? There's a ship. I'm in danger. And it's another factory. Huh. So, it's... It's a prototype or something. Let's just use normal weapons since... What is that? What are those? What the heck? Oh no. Shields. I need shields. Oh, what are those? You know what? I want their drone control offline. Shields? Shields? Please? What is going on? 
Oh, maybe those are just revealing things. Oh. Okay. What? Those things are weird. Hmm. But yeah, I think those things just reveal things. Uh, let's go to distress. Sure, why not? Someone in distress? Let's help him. You follow the distress beacon to a small asteroid belt. You find a small ship struggling to maneuver through the field. They message you, Help! Our shields are down and I don't know how much longer we can last. <laughs> Try to shield their ship with yours and just get them out of the field. I'm gonna take damage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But your ship took a number. They offer you some scrap and thanks. I'm on fire! One cool thing, when you're on fire, just open up a uh, airlock and suffocate it. That's a nice little attention to detail. Well, sh I don't think we can afford taking it a long way. The fleet seems to be catching up on us. Yeah, uh, glad I didn't take the long way. Alright, let's just jump to the exit. Main planet of the sector, a major jump relay located here, allows spaceships to perform extreme long range, ugh, long range jumps. The place is quite busy. Several vessels wait in line and prepare to travel closer to the Federation core world, undoubtedly fleeing from the slowly approaching rebel fleet. They are slow. This beacon seems to serve as a meeting place for local traffic. It seems you can find crew willing to fight on your ship here for a price. So yeah. I guess I'll end this episode here. It's been um, pretty fun playing this. We'll have to do more of it later and see how far I can get. Hopefully I won't die soon. And it'll just suck. The next video will be like two minutes. And then it'll be 15 minutes of just black screen. But yeah. Let's uh, hope that I can make it. And I'll see all of you in the next video. Bye.